During the night of May 16, 1943, a squadron of specially modified Lancaster bombers set out to attack three dams in the Ruhr Valley in Germany. This might not sound surprising in the middle of the Second World War, but the bombs used for this air raid had a unique feature. Designed by British engineer Barnes Wallace, the bombs, codenamed Upkeep, were able to skip across the water in a similar way to skipping stones across a lake. The design included a spinning drum in the nose, and when released at a predetermined height and speed, the forward spinning motion of the bomb created a difference in pressure between the bottom and top surfaces. As the bomb hit the water, this difference caused it to rise slightly off the surface and bounce forward towards its target. When the target was reached, the bombs sunk to a specific depth that had been precisely calculated to cause the most damage when exploding. Now made famous by the film Dam Busters, the raid was considered a success, and two dams were destroyed that night, flooding vast areas of German infrastructure. However, there were many lives lost amongst both the Air Force and German civilians.